Can NLP and hypnosis help somebody with Asperger's? I want to talk today about um, something that I did that surprised me that it actually worked because it's not an area that I deal with but I've been asked over the last couple of weeks to work with uh, two people with Asperger's and my initial reaction was well I don't know whether I've got anything that I can offer these people and the first one I actually saw the mother of the child with Asperger's who had become um, literally phobic of his younger brother and he also suffered from OCD type behaviour and all I did was explain to her about NLP and how the mind works and how we make pictures inside our mind, how we talk to ourselves and how that generates feelings and what she did from this was she spoke to him and she said you know when you feel like this what are you picturing inside your mind and he looked at her and he said these like hundreds and hundreds of big angry black balloons just coming at me over and over and over and what she said to him was well you're good at zapping things why don't you just zap them and make them go away and he looked at his mom and he says can I do this he says yes of course you can anyway from that moment on and a little bit more work of working out what he was doing inside his head she said everything calmed down and he actually was able to be in the same room as his brother which he hadn't been before and he told his brother that he loved him and so I thought wow you know I wanted to share this with any of you that may have a relative who has Asperger's to maybe look into NLP to see what you can do to get inside their world and help them to change it because we create our reality through pictures inside our mind's eye whether we're aware of it or not through how we talk to ourselves whether we're aware of that or not which then generates the feelings and if you can go in and change those sub modalities as we call them the inner workings then it will change the feelings for example a simple strategy say if I wanted to master depression now I don't recommend this I'd have to have a black cloud in front of my eyes because otherwise if I had a bright future I couldn't do depression well so if I have the black cloud if I have my physiology down and if I talk to myself in a certain way of oh nothing works nothing changes I can maintain this state of depression now I know this is a very simplistic view and there's a lot more to it than that but this is all that this lady did was to enter into her son's world and say well how does it look like to you from the inside what are you seeing when you close your eyes you know what are you saying to yourself and she was then offering alternative ways to picture things and to talk to himself differently and offering alternatives of you know use your zapper and burst those balloons and just that simple thing helped him calm down because when you think about it if inside your head you were seeing all these balloons coming at you all the time and you couldn't turn it off it was relentless then how on earth could you function well anyway great talking to you today and I hope it may be of use to you bye now